Hey there, a lot of exciting things happening in Xena Intelligence. Um, just wanted to give an overview of the latest investor update that we are uh, sending across. So the heading is organic growth. There's been a lot of organic growth that's been happening at Xena, primarily because of the product-led strategy that uh, we have um, pushed for over the last few weeks, especially with the launch of Xena Foresight, which is which has been incredible, the amount of support uh, that we have received from potential customers. Um, so moving on to Xena Foresight, the goal behind building Foresight obviously was to help the hundreds and thousands and possibly millions of brands who are struggling with optimizing their listings on Amazon. With the advent of uh, large language models and all this expertise that we have built along the years, I think it just seems like a straightforward thought to build a tool that can be easily scaled, easy to use, and extremely valuable for e-commerce managers, operators, and business owners who either do not have the expertise or the time to manage their online listings starting from Amazon. We have received some um, incredible inputs from the early customers. People have come organically. People have used it, given the feedback, and it seems uh, it seems to be quite addictive in terms of the usage patterns for some of the customers that we have seen along the way. Um, like I said earlier, we built it to solve a very huge pain point, and the idea could be uh, potentially very large in terms of the impact and the value that it can create for potential customers and the TAM or total addressable market, uh, that means the number of brands that are selling online is growing quite a bit. On an average, every single day from one of the reports that I read, there are more than 2000 new brands that are joining the e-commerce space. Uh, the entry to barrier for brands to sell in the e-commerce space has reduced massively, which means that there is a lot of opportunity for support systems like Foresight to come into the market and help these sellers out. And that's one of the reasons why we began. Um, Xena has also seen a considerable growth in uh, e-commerce traffic, views, and engagement across different platforms. We felt that what we were doing was so helpful to potential users that we started putting out content. We started putting uh, more of what we were doing outside. And it we have also received a lot of positive feedback on not just the product side, not just the technology side, but also from other founders um, who have um, who have lent their hand in support in understanding the work that we are doing. Um, talking of R and D, uh, I recently released a video in which I talk about the need for balancing between product innovations, cutting edge innovations that do not exist, versus working towards incrementally improving your existing product, and that is something that we are um, experiencing right now where my team obviously is very excited to build new things to build think out of the box but at the same time it's very important to make sure that we receive uh, the existing customer feedback either directly or through looking at the data and make sure that there is a substantial roadmap for incremental product updates which we are working towards and an example of that is the launch of Z Foresight Vision, which basically means that one can upload their product image, one or more of them, and then uh, Foresight will be able to generate a listing, a very compelling product listing that they can easily use to list their products up. We're also working on a few other uh, projects like Foresight Pulse, which aims to use the customer reviews or the feedback that um, a brand receives or its competitor receives to help improve its product positioning in the market. Well, we have had a few conversations with our customers. Our Titan Caskets was one of them. It's fascinating how they've been able to attract massive influencers like MKBHD, Taylor Swift, and a couple of others. Um, they're one of a unique brand that sells caskets online, arguably the market leader, doing exceptionally well in multiple channels. And we are proud to partner with them and help working with them. I've also spoken to uh, Molly and Hannah from Must Love. Uh, they're fantastic uh, entrepreneurs. They sell uh, graham crackers on Amazon. They're doing extremely well. They came on Shark Tank. They're one of, one of the examples of entrepreneurs who are extremely resilient and extremely uh, persevering. Even when things are not looking good, they just move ahead. And I'm proud to have uh, a partnership with them, working with them for, I think it's it's been about a year right now and uh, looking at the growth that they have it's uh, they're not stopping anytime soon so this is the latest company update on Xena which has been going to 
all our investor update list.